Maybe it's time to upgrade my mouse pad. I'll go the hard route. No, I don't like that. Ow! I think I cut myself. This one's made of glass. Shit. Yeah, I can't go wrong with an old favorite, right? So this is the MPC 890 Kodora Gaming Mousepad Stealth Edition, which you can see, you can't see it, from Endgame. Now I got this from Amazon and I ordered the navy blue. And if you notice, the, the reflection from my keyboard kind of looks blue, but this thing is black, as you can tell it's black. I've had several people look at it and I've said, hey, what color is this? And they look at me like I'm stupid and go it's black what do you see so i sent it back and got and ordered it again thinking that maybe their stock was weird and i got this again and it's black and now i'm having another focusing problem i swear i'm gonna i'm gonna review this camera and it's not gonna be good so anyway i'm even using my least favorite mouse the logitech pro g lightspeed yeah with my little cozies on it um i hate this mouse anyway so this is the uh, 890 version, which is the 890 by 450 millimeter. I can't even show you this thing. It, it's it's 35 by 17.7, so it covers most of my my area here, which is great because I like it. It feels good. Uh, it's it's not abrasive. Kind of feels like it, but it's not. Um, and your keyboard does not slide, but your mouse does. So nice. It is that in between. What I was looking for is something that was in between a cloth and a glass. Uh, the cloth, they get dirty, they start to feel ugh, um, and then they get a little bit abrasive. I mean, even the better ones, eventually they just kind of, you know, they wear down. Every time you do this, you're losing mouse pad. You do this, you lost mouse pad. See what I mean? With this, this is material that they use for luggage. So it has these little bitty, it's almost like corduroy, like a micro corduroy, probably because it's called Kodora, right? So your mouse is like just kind of going across these little fabric beads, which makes it slide. But it doesn't, it does, it's not out of control. That's what's great about it. It's like the Goldilocks, right? It's not, it's not too slow or abrasive, but it's also not too fast. So it's right in the middle and is exactly what I was looking for. Isn't it great when you find something that's just like, this is what I was looking for, and I found it. It's fantastic. Now, they do have two other models. They have a 450, which is a 450 by 400 millimeter, or if you live in the States, that would be um, 17 by 7 by 15 and a quarter, and three quarters, sorry. 
And then they also have a giant one, which is the 1200, 1200 by 600 millimeter, which is 47 by 24 inches. So I, I kind of wanted that one, but I, I don't, my desk area, it would just be draping off. So I promise. So as far as the, the material and the durability, it's, it's basically waterproof. Um, I've, I have dropped salsa on it, wiped it off. It's like it wasn't even there. But the main thing is, is this is really probably one of the best upgrades I've done since getting back into PC as far as my performance playing games. Um, you know, you can get a better mouse and you can get a better keyboard. You can get a better monitor. You can get everything better. It, none of that makes you a better player. Even this is, is not really making me a better player. But it does help aiming because I have more control on where I'm going with my mouse it's not it doesn't slow it down and it doesn't super speed it up it's just it's just right and this is for me you know yeah, try it out uh, with those three sizes I think you can find something that is absolutely your uh, you know desk size or whatever and with those two available colors um, I'm hoping that Endgame will shed some light on that and say, oh, you know, no, 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 the ones on our website are blue and black, you, you know, and two different colors. So if they update that, uh, I hope they let me know soon. So that's about it. I just wanted to kind of show you this isn't something that you can kind of go over specs with, you know, but and it's not something I can even really show you. It's just something you have to feel. And that's that's something on this channel that I try to. Uh, I, I try to emphasize because I don't think a lot of people do like this mouse for instance I hate the way it feels it's a popular mouse everybody told me to get this mouse it's like what mouse should I get everybody said the same I, I hate it I like my 305 better than this mouse so it just really depends on what you like how it feels to you and that's what I try to do how this feels to me it is absolutely perfect i have had no problem with this whatsoever and if this you know caught fire or if uh you know had to put out a fire with it which you probably could i would i would absolutely go buy another one immediately because this is this is like my this is my end game <laughs> Pun intended. so yeah so anyway if you like the review please leave a like sub you know all that good stuff i've got another review that i'm working on and kind of a a mouse expo kind of thing coming in uh but those deliveries are delayed so it might take me a little bit longer uh, but tune in tune in later and see what i got going on until then you guys have fun playing